Hi, I'm Ryan. I'm at uh, DBS Bristol and I'm doing a workshop on mixing Atmos in film. So in film, film is about telling a story and uh, it's using all these different elements to kind of help tell this story and yeah, there's emotion, there's all these things we're trying to get across. So um, as, when you're working on the sound, I think you've got to, on every little level of the film, you've got to be looking at what can you can do and put in there to try and help tell that story and get, get these things across. Um, so as a kind of just like touching the basics, uh, we have diegetic sound and non-diegetic sound. The diegetic is obviously stuff which is based in the film. Uh, in that world, and then we have um, non-diegetic, non which is then obviously things which are outside the world. So a good example is uh, something within the world, dialogue, people talking to each other, put a cup down. Um, and then uh, in terms of w what's not within the film world, we have score, um, but then we can transition, like a very typical thing is like, you know, music is playing and then we transition into the radio or it's coming out you know, in the car. Um, and then also in, like in a horror film, we use sound design. So the, the characters in the film, they can't hear what's going on, but we as an audience hear that and we know something's about to go down. Um, and these are all the different tools. Um, and yeah, um, what I like to do is in terms of uh, working in film, in terms of like career paths, um, in, in, in terms of sound, there's kind of three groups, um, which I like to call the three disciplines. So you've got dialogue, music and effects. Um, people do tend to work across, you know, some, some of these, but generally a lot of people kind of dedicate and go down one path. So in terms of like music's quite a very separate thing where you have like a composer and music editors and they kind of a little bit of their own entity. And then in terms of if you're supervising and looking after uh, the post sound dialogue and effects are kind of they're the two groups which really work closely together. Um, so yeah, in terms of dialogue, uh, we have obviously dialogue, which is everything which is shot. Uh, on set. We have ADR, um, which is then afterwards um, automated dialogue replacement. Uh, we have RT or FUTs, which is uh, radio, um, people talking on the radios. Uh, in an action film, you know, people are uh, running around guns, talking on radios, all that kind of stuff. And then you have crowd. Um, and crowd's quite an extensive job uh, because generally they'll go and film, uh, sorry, record a bunch of crowds if you're in Africa you'll get a bunch of uh, actors who are African speaking and building, you know, it's helping to build the world through the dialogue. Um, music, there's score and source. So source is anything which is coming from a source within the world. And score is you know, obviously all the cool, nice emotional music. Uh, and then in terms of effects, which is kind of what I generally specialize in, um, then you have uh, effects, which you have what we call spot effects. So doors, punches, um, all the, or some people call it hard effects as well. Um, then you've got uh, backgrounds um, and ambiences and they help to establish the scenes and, and the world. And then you have Foley, um, which is, them and hard effects can kind of, they kind of merge together, but generally like Foley is used uh, anything that's which recorded in a Foley studio and someone's performing it and it's not coming from a library. Um, and kind of all of these come together to build this, this world.